the core values was a big part of our summer, and that's how we spent a ton of time doing that. Uh, this preseason, we've talked a lot about focusing on our preparation. And what we mean by the preparation is, we mean our practice habits, uh, getting in the gym outside of practice for extra shooting, our lifting sessions, our nutrition, our sleep, all of the things that lend you to becoming as good of a player as you can be and, and us ultimately becoming as good of a team as we can. Uh, a lot of times I think players get focused on, you know, what's my role gonna be? How much am I gonna play? Um, all the things that, that kind of work themselves out and, and we try to avoid that focus as much as we can and just talk about, just focus on getting as good as you can possibly get this, this preseason. Uh, our team will do the same thing and, and then we'll roll into games ready to go. Yeah, so I think one of our biggest strengths this year is going to be the, the versatility of our front court. Um, everybody knows about Nathan Knight, or almost everybody does. Uh, obviously, he's got a really unique skill set for his size. Uh, Andy Van Vliet uh, is the same type of player, and I envision those two playing quite a bit together. Uh, I think they could be a real matchup problem for a lot of teams, and uh, we'll run a lot of the offense through both of those guys. So uh, I'm excited about you know, playing a lot through those guys and, and the versatility they bring, and uh, I think that could be a big strength for us this season. So I think the biggest challenge that this team has had right now is probably just with what we focus on. And, you know, we've talked a lot about just, again, focus on that preparation, just focusing on doing your job and, and just being concerned with that. Uh, I think we have some guys who, who do focus a little bit too much on, on their roles or, or you know, how much are they scoring or getting shots and, and those kind of things. And that's a problem that, that takes a while to correct and something that we have to consistently work on. Our guys have made some good strides with it, but, um, but we need to continue doing that in order for us to be a really successful team this year. From a leadership standpoint, I think uh, Nathan Knight is, is going to be one of the biggest ones we have. Uh, he has done a great job of, of really trying to embrace that role here. Um, but just with, with the play he's, he's capable of, uh, he's a natural uh, vocal person, so he's, he, he's got that with him. And, and I think he's really embraced the idea of being a leader here for this team and going into his senior year. Uh, some of the other guys that I think can have some real leadership roles for us, um, Bryce Barnes and Tyler Hamilton, who are both graduate transfers for us that, that bring some really good experience. Um, Luke Lowy is one of the better leaders I've been around in terms of leading by example. Uh, and we've talked to him about expanding his, his vocal leadership leadership. Uh, and then from the younger class, uh, a guy who's been really good uh, as a vocal leader has been Thornton Scott. And um, he's, one of the, he's one of the loudest guys at practice and, and it's, uh, it, it's been a really good thing. And you know, when you can get some leadership from, from some younger classes, that's, that's always real positive. Yeah, I think what I'm most excited about is how far this team can can uh, grow and develop. You know, we, we've talked a lot about laying the foundation for, for this season and this program. Uh, and when you do that, you got to go a little bit slow. And, and you got to get that foundation in like you want it. You can't skip any steps, uh, which means when you go into your first you know, a few games, you might not have everything in that you want to have. You might not be prepared for every single thing you might see in, at the first game. And, and I'm okay with that because we are spending that time on that foundation. And, and I think if we can get that in place uh, like we want to with this group, I think this group has a chance to be, you know, a really good team towards the end of the season and, and can really improve uh, from, you know, games in November all the way through conference play and, and into the conference tournament. Family on three, one, two, three. Family.